Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and this is um, an updated video. I did a video explaining this a uh, few months back. I get tons and tons of people saying, hey, your wallpapers are incredible. Where do you get them? And basically I use Microsoft's own um, way of getting themes from the Microsoft Store. So if you want to have these wallpapers, and I actually change now because Halloween's coming up, it's fall, so maybe I could find something that has to do with, um, you know, this time period here in Canada. That's the, uh, I often like to have that depending on the season. So you simply go to your settings. Once in your settings, what you'll want to do is go into personalization. And in here, on the left side, you'll see themes. So you see the ones that I have pre-installed and now I will has actually go and get more themes in Microsoft Store. So it opens the store where you will have different themes available and you can of course check out the different options that you see here. So let me check out what we have in here uh, that could be interesting for this time of year. Uh, Autumn in Sweden looks nice. What else do we have? Anything else that could go with this time of the year? Animals in Autumn there. That looks nice. A little cat in the colored leaves. And you click. Once you click here, you'll see this. You just click Get. Of course, you have all the information available with some of the pictures that are uh, in preview and this app when you actually uh, have this available so you could see the some of the pictures you'll you'll get here it will download to your computer and once it's downloaded and remember these are packs of images so some are a little bigger than others it depends on the uh, package that you will of course check now here there's a button called apply and very often they actually don't apply so instead of doing that go back to your themes uh, and double click on the theme that you just downloaded so animals in autumn double click and it will now have been applied so you see it changes not only the wallpaper by the way it changes your colors so uh, you might want to use a custom theme make sure that the colors and the background depending on you know if you have uh, some visual impairment maybe you don't want to have some of the colors sometimes they choose they're not always perfect but now if we look at my background here we go one of these pictures and of course there's many pictures that you have around here you can cycle through these pictures if you want and uh, this is really really nice you have an option called next desktop background so when you want to change it you can click and it actually moves immediately to another one so that's basically where I get most of my themes because they're so beautiful. The big majority of them is actually in, created by Microsoft itself. And uh, that is uh, just beautiful. And uh, this is available since, I believe, the April 2018 update, if not even uh, creator's update. So uh, even if you're on previous versions of Windows, this is available. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, Thanks for watching.